Hi everyone, I'm back. I haven't been uh, making a video for a while. I am back. Uh, a few things to show you. Lovely new updates to the website, products and pages that I've added. So my name is Mariah and I'm the owner and maker of Luxury Back Heaven, which was previously Edinburgh Bloom. So you may have been following me since I was in the Blooms. It's now Luxury Back Heaven. All the same, I'm still here, just uh, trying to build a business around luxury bags uh, and everything you need for luxury bags. So we've got organizers, shapers, we've got conversion kits. And before I get into the topic of this video, which is the beautiful conversion kit uh, for the cosmetic pouch, I just wanted to show you my leather care products, which are for bags. So it doesn't matter if your bag is expensive or, you know, if you just want to clean it or restore it, if you want to keep it waterproof, um, I'm here for you. There's two big sort of like main products that I really, really like, and that is the cleaner and the protector. So you would clean your bag first, you would then spray it to waterproof it as well as nourish the leather so i know the lovely person that has sent me this one to review and uh, test the conversion kit for has done that on tabs and it's all waterproof now obviously if you've got bigger bags and um, if you've got leather bags it all works and you get a really really cute mitten which i make and that's to sort of buff it in make sure um that the material you know the product's been applied evenly and it just works well with these two so lots and lots of videos on tiktok a couple of shorts on youtube please stay tuned that is all on luxurybagheaven.com and .co.uk and now i would like to show you the beautiful conversion kit which i have in front of me because um it has been sent to me by a lovely group uh, member she's sort of my instagram friend follower we tag each other lovely mountain um, i'm gonna tag her below you can follow her she has got this for the summer and i just wanted to show you how it's been converted and what fits in and what you can get when you buy the luxury bag heaven conversion kit stay tuned back um i've just picked up a few things so i want to show you what fits after i showed you how the conversion kit works i hope you watched this video because you'd like to con convert your bag and you're considering that just a few things to note and uh sort of like a little bit of a you know like a side of caution about how to use the kit and what you would probably need to uh do to have your kit um used safely because i encourage you to do that i don't encourage you to sort of like not respect your bag because we are talking about a cosmetic pouch which has been altered and um, so you need to be mindful how much goes in so that's something i really want to stress out and please do it with your own sort of like just be just be responsible and use it wisely um don't overload it it's not a big bag to start with so i don't see a point of overloading it uh, in general so what you would start with your conversion kit would be your insert. So that's all handmade by myself. Um, it's just a really nice fit. You can get it for the PM or GM. You get your nice pocket. You can add pockets. It just keeps it nice and clean. It means that if you don't use it for like converting it, you can just take the rings out and use it for your actual toiletries, you know, and makeup. So you get that lovely thing. Then second most important ingredient would be your rings uh, which are they're not tricky to put on but it took me a few minutes to figure it out and I have made a little chart so I would try to put it in here at the end of the video possibly if not it's on my website um, how to actually put the ring in so we've already got the rings in um, and you do get your strap if you want you don't have to but uh, just a little demonstration. I don't want to take this one off because it does require a screw, a small screw, because one end needs to be screwed in. But what I was trying to do, which was wrong, I was trying to put the rod in first, and then I was trying to put the actual ring. So that is wrong, don't do that. This is why I made the chart. You have to do it together. So what you would need to do, please listen, is 
put the ring where it needs to be. Okay, so round about here. And then you insert the little rod and then you screw it in place. Okay, so it goes through the ring, into the tab, comes out on the other side. Okay, and then you screw it in and it looks like this. It goes up and down, but it doesn't go sideways because it's the right size, which I sourced um, to actually fit properly without moving because you don't want it traveling too much. And when it's inside the tab and all screwed in, it just stays in place. Okay, so please learn from my mistake, save yourself five minutes in frustration and do it the way I showed you. <laughs> Moving on, we have got two types of chain. We have got the dainty, which I really, really like. It's my favorite. I just think it's beautiful. Um, it's my sort of Felicity style chain, which I like to sell. Um, but I also have the chunky flat, which a lot, a lot of people really, really like. And for the conversion kits on the website, you can choose either. So I've been generous to offer you two, not just one. And if you've got silver, um, conversion kits requirements then you would just let me know and I would source you a silver chain so the chain's already on the bag it's on this side I'm just going to clip it back and let's move on to what fits into the pouch so easy to connect rings are on insert and I'm just going to start inserting some things slowly because I want to see what actually fits so hang on so most important item to me is a phone for the cosmetic GM which is the size I'm reviewing it really fits well I don't think it fits in the PM right so there's loads and loads of space and um, moving on what else do I like to take with me I've got my little clay which I've made it's repurposed canvas but if you've got a Louis Vuitton one by all means I have got my keys which is the fob also on the website so let's just put them in. Um, I have got sunglasses or sort of glasses in general, so I'm just going to stick that in as well. That's my pouch. Um, so there's always a pair of some sort of glasses in my bag. Um, and I've got like, so now moving on to like really essentials, which for me would be my lipstick and my hand gel. So those have to fit in and they do. Obviously there's still space. Um, it is building up a little bit now, uh, but there's still plenty of space, like you can see it. You could probably fit in, I don't know, what else can you fit? What else do people need? Tissue paper. Let's just go with tissues. Yeah. So really, really easy to sort of fill up. It's not too full. I think it's got, it's still got space. But as explained earlier, please be mindful of what you carry, right? So if it feels like your bag's getting too heavy, you might want to offload and put some less things in it. Uh, you can close it up easily. So just beautiful. Obviously, it's a beautiful Louis Vuitton piece and it's just nice to have as an option for a bag. And now I'm going to attempt to put it on because <laughs> I have not taken it onto the street. Like I have not used it outside because obviously it's not mine but it just sits like this so the chain's really keeping it like on a nice level this is 120 centimeter okay it's sitting really nice and low on the hip it's flat against the body which I like so you can see there's like it's a flat uh, pouch basically um and it feels really secure it feels like sturdy it feels it feels nice like i have to say it really does personally i would sort of maybe go for the monogram pouch because that's just my preference but for the summer how beautiful is this okay so if you stayed so far you you have been shown how to put the rings on what you get in the kit and what fits um anything else that you might require there is a new page on the website which is the conversion kit page as well as the leather care so this is what I showed you at the start anything that comes to mind about this or another SLG you'd like to convert there's a Gucci conversion section I've got Mulberry conversions um, 
there is a lot to do with small leather goods um, that can be made into a bag and this is one of them. I'm really, really happy and thankful for the opportunity to review it and show it to you. It's just, it's just a beautiful piece and it's nice to have a little bit of an option. So if you've already owned a pouch, that is a great thing to do, just to convert it for when you need it. Um, and if you don't own it, maybe you want to own something nice that's sort of azure for the summer or you want to go for monogram. Um, it's just a really, really nice option. Um, and it's like, I would say it's affordable because this piece isn't within the thousands. You know, you can source it um, and find it on different selling platforms. Um, I also have a group, so maybe you find one in my group. So come and join on. Um, if you stayed so far, please go and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, there's a lot of content. I'm really, really bag addicted. So you would see a lot of content. <laughs> day to day, in stories and in posts and everything. So if you like that kind of thing, please, please follow. Um, my website is luxurybyheaven.com or .co.uk. Um, please get in touch if you need anything else. Um, and it was really, really nice to speak to you again. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day. Bye.